um, I'm looking forward to seeing him bat. Um, I can learn plenty from him. So I think for us, it'll just probably focus on what we can control and the bowlers be clear and bowl the best balls they can and hopefully he can make a mistake. And how confident you are that you are going to win the trophy this time as well? Yeah, I think going into a match, you always got to think that you can win. Um, obviously, Pakistan are a strong side, as I said before, so we'll have to be at our best um, and fingers crossed we can get it done. Look like a full spinner. Um, hopefully it's a bit of both. Hopefully um, it offers a little bit of pace in the first innings and with the warm weather, hopefully it breaks up in the second innings and the spin can come into play. Do you see Todd Murphy playing a role at all? Yeah. Breaking into the SGM after? Yeah, definitely. I think Todd, um, he's done a really good job when he's got his opportunity for Australia. Um, hopefully he can continue to grow and, um, and get better and hopefully we see a good performance out here for him. Well, what has made the World Cup yes, man. Challenging, as I said, they're a national side and some of the stars in their team are, are awesome players and players I really look up to. So we'll have our hands full this week for okay. sure. Um, but the selectors have picked, you know, a, a really strong Prime Minister's eleven. So hopefully we can put up a good fight and um, get on the right side of the wing would be nice. Do you have any? Does that thing also balance? Do you think you'll go with and how close to the Test eleven do you think it will look tomorrow? I think you're, you're spot on with it being a four day first class fixture. Um, we'd like to manage some loads as well. So it might be possible that we rest a couple of players that we feel have, have worked a lot in, 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 the, recent, in the recent past. Um, but look, we've got 18 players. Um, we've got seven fast bowlers. Probably gives us an ideal opportunity to test which combination we might be taking with us to, to Perth. And, and it'll be a great test for the batsmen uh, having Probably two innings in these four days would be would be a good test against against a very good attack. Um, and uh, again, we'll 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 just try and get the best preparation out. Of it. As a batsman coming to Australia, what are the biggest adjustments you have to make, particularly when you're starting a series in somewhere like here? Um, pace and bounce, obviously. Um, that's something that that's a that's a given in Australia. Um, we've been very fortunate that a lot of the guys were part of. Uh, the 2019 tour, some even came during the 2016 tour, which is sort of a replica of this series in terms of the fixture list, um, except Perth and, and Brisbane being switched. Um, we were lucky to play the, the, the T20 World Cup last year. Um, I, I felt as a batsman those were testing conditions, but we still did a decent job as a batting unit there. So there are a lot of the guys who've, who've gotten that experience and, and it's, it's the pace and bounce in Australia and their, and their um, pace attack, along with Nathan Lyon, that that, that you want to get used to and, and you want to put under pressure right from the word go because um, they've dominated world cricket for a while.